I must go to Bethlehem. Uh? It's my native town. And, and Mary must come with me. Why? For the census. So even Augustus obeys God. The prophecy? Yes, the prophecy. For thou, O Bethlehem, art in no wise the least of cities. For from thee shall come forth a shepherd of my people, Israel. If only I could come with you. If only I... Joseph, you need help when he's born. Don't be troubled, Anna. He would be well cared for. Everything will be done as God ordered. They seem to be kings, Lord Melchior, from different lands. I told you we could not have been the only ones to see the sign.
I'm sure that Herod keeps a strict watch on his frontiers. He must know that we have crossed them. I would have to tell him, as Balthazar has said, that I follow that star wherever it leads. But what will we find? All my calculations show that there was to be a new heavenly creature, a new star. It was even precise as to place and time. So I made up my mind to set forth and seek what they would unfold. You did not know? Only that it would be something wonderful. The stars are not distant and aloof, cut off from the lives of men. The rising of a new star entails an immense labor in the heavens that always has its counterpart on Earth. The universe is about to bring forth a prodigy beyond our understanding. Your star, my brother, Balthazar, is indeed a sign of wonder. The divine Zoroaster says the next prophet will show himself in a foreign land. And the truth he will reveal will be at first only for his own people. But there is only one truth. And only one God. All the rest are vain or parts of him. The people of Israel know this. Many of their wise men have been close to him. And their writings confirm my calculations. A king is about to be born. Thought I heard a baby crying. Born in a stable. Oh, a beautiful child. Come and put him there in the manger and see if there's some fresh straw that'll keep him warm. I'll take care of her, poor girl. Then, have you some water? Give it to me. Come, that's it. Who's that? What do you want? 
This is no place for you. Get out. Get out, do you hear me? Off, off with you. Can't you see? Poor girl just had a child. That's why we've come. We were told to. Told? By who? We were out there in the fields. This man came to us from nowhere. An angel. Shepherds, he said. They say that Israel is a scattered flock that lacks a shepherd. And then he said, tonight the shepherd is born. It is for you that he comes, he said, for the poor. That's why you came here? Yes. The man said... He said... The man said, today, in the city of David, a savior has been born for you. Glory to God in the highest, he said, and peace on earth for those whom he loves. Come. 